Welcome. So when I'm solving these types of problems, especially with anger relationships, I always like to write in what exactly the relationship is. So therefore, it kind of helps me as far as um, being able to solve it. So you can see we have two parallel lines. So I'm automatically thinking parallel lines, transversal, angle relationships. What angle relationships come up? Alternate interior, alternate exterior, corresponding, same side interior. Um, so I notice that these two angles are interior of my parallel lines, and they're on opposite sides of the transversal. Therefore, I can call these alternate interior. And the reason why I know that because alternate interior, alternate exterior, and as well as corresponding are all equal to each other. Um, so they're equal in measure. Therefore, 124, so a lot of times equal in measure. So therefore, I can just write an equation 124 equals 2x plus 18. This is so important because when I know they're equal in measure, I can write an equation. Now I can solve for my variable. So to do that, I'll subtract 18 on both sides. And therefore, I get 106 equals 2x. Divide by 2, divide by 2, 53 equals x. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you solve using alternate interior angles. Thanks.